They're ignorant to the fact. Yeah. Did you know I find it today that uh, it's uh, very hard to try to get people acquainted with God's way. Yeah. You can hardly acquaint them with yeah. God's way. You see, they have walked in the ways of darkness so long. They have heard lies preach yeah. so long. Yeah. Till when the truth of God comes along, it don't sound right to us. Yeah. We say every religion, every worldly religion in the world is wrong and not one of them right. That don't sound right to them. Yeah. 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 They want to think something right. Yeah. But there's nothing in the world that can be right and nothing is right unless it's like this which we preach. Amen. That's the truth of it. Amen. Might not sound right, but it's right. Amen. Nothing in the world can be right. Amen. Nothing is right. Amen. Unless it's like this which we preach. Amen. Amen. And you don't find many folk preaching this. Amen. Isn't that true? Amen. But uh, as I said before, seeing the condition of the people and everything hell bound, even uh, them that surround you and many times them that supposed to be in the church. Amen. You know, this thing kills everything inside and outside. Amen. Many times folks in the church just playing around, going along. Yeah. And when you see them like that, they're going to hell too. Sure. Uh, it doesn't make any difference how much gospel that the chief preach if you don't obey the word it won't benefit you Amen. you got to after being a hearer of the word then you got to turn around and be a doer yeah. mm-hmm. is that right Amen. 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 it don't just uh, pay you to sit up here and hear what he say and Amen, just go around and then do like you want to do you got to obey what he preach Amen. is that right Amen. Amen. but then seeing the uh, the condition of the world outside and that everything is hellbound. And then looking around in the church and seeing that it's not but uh, really a few people that is sincere. It, it, it's grievous. Amen. Amen. It, 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 it even as the prophet said, uh, Jeremiah uh, 23 and 9, say that uh, it, it's heartbreaking. Amen. Seeing that you uh, have preached the truth to the people, and then when you look around, they have moved from what you preach. Amen. That's great. Yes. Uh, that's just like in the natural. Amen. You have a daughter and send her to school, and uh, she graduates from high school, and then she wants to go to college, and you sacrifice and send her. Amen. At uh, a sacrifice, and then she graduates from college. And uh, does nothing with her education but goes out here and marry some bum. Huh? Go out here and marry a bum. Some old wino. You know, you wouldn't be happy over that. My God, you said I sacrificed many days for her. And I tried to give her the best and this thing. And, and look what she have done. Married a bum. That would grieve you. Would it do so? Your son, you send him to school and then he get educated and go out here and be uh, a dope addict? A dope addict? That would be grievous. Now, in the church, the man of God laboring and dying on his feet and preaching the gospel to the people. And then when you look around, they're not walking according to the word. Amen. Do you know that's a grievous thing? Amen. The thing that makes the man of God happy and make him, amen, feel good is when he preaches the word and can look around at the folks and see they obeying it. Amen. amen. Then you know that you have benefited amen. somebody. Amen. That gives you joy. Amen. See your children amen. walking in the truth. Yes. Yes. My God, but when you preach it and then they, they rebel you against it and amen, fail to walk in it and you see, amen, and not profit them anything, it's grievous. Yes, it is. Huh? It's grievous. My God, but when they walk in it, 
It gives you joy. Amen. 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 You can look on them and smile on them. Yeah, that's right. so thank God they have heard the word. And not only have they heard it, they have obeyed it. Because they have, I see them walking in truth. Yeah. Huh? Yeah. That gives a man of God joy. Yeah. Yeah. Glory be to God. Yeah. Otherwise, it's grievous to it. Yeah. Jeremiah said, Jeremiah 23 and 9. My heart within me is broken. My heart within me is broken. Because of the prophets. My God, when you see that false prophets all over this world is deceiving the people. Yes. Yes. On the way to hell, and uh, <laughs> seemingly, uh, uh, even though you preach it, it, it don't seem to turn them much. Oh, yeah. Very few people turn. My God, God, they'd rather hear a false prophet. Yeah. Old false prophet, some old uh, cunning crafter, uh, working cunningness, and he, man, he can write them a letter and tell them to send him money. Yeah. He'll send them a prayer cloth. Yes, sir. Amen. And he'll pray for them. Amen. They'll do all kinds yeah. of things. Huh? Amen. Amen. But the truth of God, you'll find it that really the majority of the people don't want it. Oh, huh? Amen. Amen. You, you tell them, say, I say, I, we have the best plan in the world. We have Jesus' plan. Amen. This is a good plan here. My God, there's nothing like old... Uh, uh, Epheless plan. Huh? Isn't that like Epheless plan? Mm -hmm. Huh? Amen. Don Stewart. No, no. Amen. Uh, uh, Eichenberger. No, no. There's no kind of plan like that. No, no. Huh? Amen. But people rather have this kind of plan. Blessing plan. Yes. Talking about a blessing plan. They, they want that. My God, what, what better blessing plan can you get than the Jesus plan? Huh? Yeah. Well, if you sin and go down in water in the name of Jesus Christ, let God fill you with the Holy Ghost. Amen. Living a holy life, that's a good plan. Yes, sir. That's the only plan that's worth anything. That's right. Amen. You can let Eichenberger go around here and fool you if you want to. I heard somebody say, he said, Eichenberger said, send for his plan. Say, you can't lose with the stuff he used. Yeah. <laughs> Already lost. But you're going to lose. Uh huh? Yeah. No other plan in the world will stand Amen. the test when the Lord come back here but the plan that God brought. Eichenberger yes. is going down. Yes. Huh? Yes. Uh, he got to go down. Yes. Amen. No other plan in the world will stand but the Jesus plan. Amen. Isn't you all glad you're in this plan? Yes. Amen. Huh? Amen. 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 And one thing about it, thank God, Amen, when you get in it, you want everybody to get in it because it's so good. Yeah. Yeah. Isn't that true? Yeah. Isn't it a good thing? Yeah. Isn't it good? Yeah. Best thing I ever had in my life. Yeah. Jesus 